Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is India and today we're gonna be doing the May reading wrap up. So unlike in March and in April, I actually read books in May. Ha ha! Got him! Got him! Hold on, I gotta get to the thing though, because you guys know I don't know which books I read. Like, you know I don't. Okay, and I should have read another one, but I didn't finish it. Mainly because I had to do other things. It's not working. Let's try it again. My book. Red. There we go, guys. Okay, so first book that I read in May was Bad Daddy by J.D. Hollyfield. I just needed to get back into reading. It was a short one, and if you can't figure it out, it is definitely a daddy kink, and it is definitely a romance. And did I enjoy it? Yeah, I did. I gave it four stars, four out of five stars. Um, the next book that I finished was Legendborn by Tracy Dion. That was my, um, book club book for May and I definitely finished it. Oh, so good. This book, guys, is so flipping good. Like, definitely read it. I gave it five out of five stars. Um, I will have a book review up about it and if you're on my Patreon, I will have a extended book review up on it. <laughs> Um, the next book I read was Tip was The Red by Tiffany Rice. Reese? I don't I never say it right, I feel like. I gave it four out of five stars. It's definitely a good Tiffany Rice. It's not as good as the headmaster. The headmaster was uh, but um but it's still really good and I really enjoyed it. Um I would definitely read it. It's a good time, it's a little mystical, it's a little magical, it's a little kink, it's a little this, a little that, it's a little lot of things. A little lot of things. So Make sure that you read it. <laughs> the next book I read was Raised by Tilly Cole, which was also the R rated book club book for May for my book club. Um, and I enjoyed it. I <laughs> I would probably give it like a 3.75 out of 5, so I rounded it up to like a 4. I know, ratings are so just whatever you want them to be. But anyway, um, I felt like there could have been more than there was, even though it was a short book. Like, it just, like, it's supposed to be this, like, mafia, this Russian mafia, underground fighting ring, guy goes missing, soulmates found each other again, you know, through the through the world that is soulmates and that's what it's supposed to be right okay and i just felt like it was missing something just missing something i enjoyed it i mean it's a very quick read it's a very quick read but mm. also um trigger warnings for non-consensual consensual sex um for that um, the last one I read, I know this is really short guys, even though I read five books, it's the same length as when I read one book. <laughs> the last one I read was Pestilence by Laura T Talassa, Tallahassee, Thalassa, Thalissa, Thalissa. I don't remember who recommended this to me. <laughs> But I'd probably give it like a 3.5 out of 5 stars. I mean like... <laughs> this is hard because I guess like I wasn't in the mindset for it. You know? I've been like in a heavy kink mood versus like romance. Ro like this isn't really like cute romance. not like contemporary romance. But anyway. um, <laughs> I like the concept of the four horsemen. That's what got me intrigued is the concept is of the four horsemen have come to earth 
and you know it's time for them to lay waste to the earth blah blah, blah. jesus wipe everybody out right revelations <laughs> go to church i'm just kidding i'm really not that into organized religion um but um <laughs> But this particular book, the whole series follows all four horsemen and this particular book follows Pestilence, the first horseman who is here to spread plague. And my illiterate dumb butt was like, let me look up the word Pestilence. And the word Pestilence does mean plague, if you were wondering, um, if you if you were, didn't want to look it up, you didn't want to seem as illiterate as myself. I looked it up, wanted to be sure, because I felt like it, because it sounds like pus, you know, pustulence. Um, but pestilence, but then I was like, it could have been, you know, like locust pests. I don't, but he's obviously not the locust guy because he's spreading plague throughout the world that they've called the fever. And our heroine, um, she tries to kill pestilence. Of course, I don't know why anybody thinks that this magical being that has come from the sky to lay waste to the earth can be killed, but they thought pestilence could be killed. So she tried it. She failed it. She was captured. <laughs> and then was a prisoner of pestilence from there on out. So yeah. It's just like okay. It's like it's, like, it's just like an okay book. Like it's there. It's cute. I mean, I don't like have to read the next ones, which is why I'm just like eh. eh. You know, I'm not like, "Oh my god, I'm ready to read the next one." Like you know, like it's high up on my TBR. I'm like, nah, man, if I decide to continue with this four horsemen journey, like I continue with this four horsemen journey, but like, I don't have to. I don't really want to. So yeah, um, yeah guys. So <laughs> that was five books in May, five. Five books, you're welcome. I feel like I did something there, you know? I just feel like I, Gone push my shoulders off. <sighs> India, stop. Stop it. <laughs> but anyway, that is it for me. Don't forget to check out all the links down in the description box. I will try and put these book, put these links to Amazon where you can easily get them. Some of them are on KU. Rays is on KU. I think Pestilence is technically on KU. I think. Bad Daddy is. Most of them are on KU, I feel like. I didn't really want to pay for anything. I already paid for KU, so... Anyway, um, so I will put those links down below in the description box as well as link for my Patreon and also signing up for um, whatever the YouTube thing is, the YouTube version of Patreon. Um, and so that way you guys can join me on all the fun that is Patreon and all that good stuff. Okay? Okay. Um, yeah, so don't forget to hit that like button. <laughs> don't forget that bell notification button so you never miss anything don't forget to follow me on all the social media and hit that subscribe button down below and until next time keep turning the pages